Hey guys, what's up? Alright, so I got another load in here and I got it was it was over to here this pile. And we got that done over there. Um so I got a little bit to spread in the morning. I'm pretty tired and dehydrated. I gotta go in and start drinking some things. Um the humidity was like 86% today all day. Um, anyways, got this all done and cleaned up. And got all this pile here cleaned up, so we're all put in there. It's looking nice, so. Yep, we are getting it done. Getting it done. So, I'm gonna come out here tomorrow and we're gonna finish that pile. Try to trim the, the crepe myrtles and some other tree low low tree limbs around and uh then just see what else there is to do but otherwise i did find these i've been looking for these i got these when i was about five or six and i found them i have access to a customer shed when i'm there i, I just do and i can use any tools if i please which is very nice i mean i try not to as much but I, uh, I found these, and I was so happy, because these are, guys, yes, the big Fiskers, you know, big loppers like those, you know, like that one there, those are wire cutters there, but, you know, loppers there too, these are really good, but these are really good for small things, if they, you know, these are perfect, I really like these, um, they don't make, thing. I don't really think they make something like this, but these grips are really nice, this thing is, these loppers must be somewhere around 10 or 11 years old. But, uh, yeah, anyways, it was nice to get these today. Find these, so, yay, they're back. I usually have them in my trailer box, but I've been looking all over for these. I think they've been up there. I think they've been up at this house for probably two or three months at least. It's crazy. And I haven't really realized a thing until all of a sudden I realized, hey, I haven't had those in a long time. I haven't seen those around and I didn't know where they went. And sure enough, they were there. There they were in their shed. I usually put my tools in there if I leave one behind, say, that I miss. It happens a lot. There's, a, there's not a lot of stuff, but there's a lot of little areas that I work when I'm there and I might forget something. Even, even, I've even missed things even after going and looking. I, I always look around and make sure, but. But, um, yeah. So anyways, we've got that. We gotta pick some uh, tomatoes and green beans in the morning. Yeah, there's going to be a bunch of them again, again, and probably a few green beans in there yet. Maybe some sugar, maybe one or two sugar snap peas, and I doubt it, but we got to try to get that done too. As I know, my, my list just, I, I, I was not, last Monday was not expected. Well, I had to finish one power washing job, then I ended up getting two more, and then I came and did some stuff from my house, but man just been busy 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 all day today doing the hauling this stuff around i got my front yard gardens looking really nice with this stuff it really does look nice my dad was happy with it so that was good it, it, it does look nice because it's kind of natural um anyway just got a bunch of little stuff in here but uh anyways that's all i got guys i'm gonna and then go get some dinner and replenish the fluids because I am not feeling good. I'm sure many of you guys understand the dehydration aspect of this this industry. Even though as much as you drink or drink water and all kind of fluids, it still just goes right through you. But uh, anyways, that's all I've got. So we'll see you guys tomorrow. We'll see what we can get down between the rains. So. I'm trying to get as much knocked out as I can. We'll see you guys later. Bye.